Hello, Cub families, and welcome to week six of remote learning. The great author John Steinbeck wrote, I have come to believe that a great teacher is a great artist and that there are as few as there are any other great artists. It might even be the greatest of the arts since the medium is the human mind and spirit. This week, as you may know, is Teacher Appreciation Week. We have great artists at U of D Jesuit who give their time, their talent, their heart and soul to form men for others for the greater glory of God. Just a week before the stay home from school order began, the faculty gathered to prepare for remote learning. They didn't complain, they didn't flinch, not without unease, they embraced the unknown, rolled up their sleeves, and immediately dove into preparation for teaching in an online learning environment. Let's look at just a sampling of student activities from this past week. Students in social studies have been engaged in debates on the Enlightenment during Zoom classes. In English, students worked on rough drafts for a five paragraph essay in peer editing groups using Zoom and Google sharing tools. Students in science studied the properties of water using interactive video and response on a tool called PlayPosit. Students in music class participated in a Zoom talent show where they had to use their instrument to, to do something creative, either play something, sing a song, show a magic trick, or tell jokes. In world language classes, students use Mudge discussion boards to post favorite quotes and then translate them and their significance in their own words. In theology, students participated in a four-part module on immigration using Google Forms that included prayer and theological reflection through art. Students in geometry observed videos of teachers working example exercises and participated in Zoom check-ins and office hours. Our school and college counselors check in with students daily using Google Forms, Zoom, Google Meet, and phone calls. And then there was Friday's first ever virtual Senate convention. Under the leadership of Ms. Ong, Ms. Estes, and Mrs. Gonzalez, weeks went into collecting, editing, and publishing an exceptional virtual event that honored the great history and tradition of the U of D Jesuit Student Senate. And our faith and service team are hard at work putting together this coming Friday's virtual Manresa Day. This will be an opportunity to reflect, meditate, and grow closer to the Lord with a selection of virtual activities and workshops that will be led by U of D Jesuit faculty and staff. Bottom line, this faculty cares deeply about their students and guiding them to be the men that God wants them to be. Even through their own personal challenges and family circumstances during this pandemic, they continue to be committed to providing excellence in Jesuit education and charism for our students. Please join me this week to give a virtual shout out, a fist bump, some Zoom love, you decide, to show our appreciation for those that engage in the greatest of the arts here at U of D Jesuit. Have a great week seven, be well, and God bless.